Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Homedale is being brought to you by BCB Bayshore, your community bank. At Hopewell Valley, it's the Group 2 semifinals. New Jersey soccer power Delran taking on Homedale. The Hornets coming into the match with an impressive 20-1 record and a huge opportunity to prove that they can get it done against the best of the best in the state. But early on, it would be Delran striking first off of a corner. Chris Hunt flips it through the box to Scott Woodington, and Woodington steps right into this one for a Delran goal. The place is going wild, and the Bears have a 1-0 lead just five minutes into the match. This Homedale team plays a physical brand of soccer, not backing down from anyone and continuously putting pressure on this Delran defense. Burkan Halalaglu comes up with the save here. Mark McStay is hit with the yellow, but that card would not slow down McStay and the Hornets. In the 38th minute, Anthony Arena serves it up in front of goal, and Mark McStay comes flying in for the equalizer. The Hornets' nest is loving it, and we're going to the break tied at one. Then, just seconds into the second half, Anthony Arena puts in a goal, Holmdell has a 2-1 lead, and they weren't done yet. The dagger comes just two minutes later in the 44th. The corner lands right at the feet of Matt Leon, and Leon punches it in. Just like that, Holmdell has a 3-1 lead. It's a three-punch combo from the Hornets, stunning Delran by scoring three goals in just six minutes of play. And there was no let up from this Hornets defense, hanging on to that 3-1 lead for the final 36 minutes of play. And it's Holmdale High School with an impressive 3-1 win over one of New Jersey's top soccer programs in Delran. You see the pure jubilation from this Holmdale team and the utter disbelief from Delran as their season comes to an end. But a special year for Holmdale continues as the Hornets have won a divisional title, a short conference championship, and now they advance to the Group 2 final at Kane University where they will take on Dover, that championship match coming up this Sunday. And after the game, I caught up with Arena and Leon talking about the Hornets' stunning win. Just a lot of energy, a lot of intensity, and they kind of came out a little bit flat, but uh, that's what that goal in the end of the first half kind of did for them. Is they kind of it's kind of stunned them. Like they thought they they were probably going to walk all over us when no team can walk all over us. Um, we're obviously a very physical team. Obviously, we don't have the height, so we just got to play our game. And like I said, these big guys they just think that they're just going to walk all over us and just take us down. But obviously, that wasn't the case. We we knew once we got the first one, they were they were, they had to be scared of us. So once once we knew they were scared, we were able just to bang them up, score on them. We play with our heart and possession, physicality. We have everything. And after winning the Shore Conference, A Central, uh, sectionals, it's, it's great. I mean, now once we take, once we take Dover, I mean, it'll be a great feeling. And I can't, I can't wait to play them. And when we come out, we're going to come out strong just like today. And to topple on them. <laughs> Reporting for Jersey Sports Zone, I'm Alex Lorenzo. Want to see highlights and features from your favorite school? Jersey Sports Zone is entirely supported by our great sponsors. Email marketing at jerseysportszone.com to get your business in front of our loyal audience and highlights from your hometown.